So yo people, welcome back to the channel and in today's video I am playing The Walking Dead uh, Season 1. Um, I've never played this game before, uh, I've only played Season 2, like halfway through Season 2. This is going to be all new to me and Season 2 had a, some spoils to this game. So yeah, let's get straight into it. This game series adapts to the choices you make. I'm a slow reader by the way. Hotel Games presents. Also, if it sounds a bit different, I've got a new type of pop filter on my microphone. So if I sound a bit louder, that's probably why. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Uh, why do you say that? Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Uh, not from me. Not from me. Because guys in your position already said it enough. <coughs> Sorry about that. You being a making boy and all. I don't even know what he said. Um uh, what do you think? I'm just glad I chose law and not order. Big messy trial like that. Even if you was innocent, a lot of what happened can't ever be undone. Keep looking. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on a six year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Um, sure. Must be nice. Sure. You gonna. Regardless, <laughs> could be you just married the wrong woman. Um, or she married the wrong guy? I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. They are a shit ton of, um, wasn't here. Crying, police cars. All over right where you sit. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I'll tell him he's got to stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Um. So did he do it? So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He Ew. sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. Oh shit. <laughs> I just did you. He just said what I just said. Am I dead? Or am I just crippled? Oh, here they come. Oh, shit. 
Yeah, I think I'm crippled. That window is so weak, or is he just got, um, drag myself out that window. he's just got strong feet. Damn, that's a big drop. Talk to the officer. Officer? He just says the same stuff again. Uh, no. Don't drop. Froze for a second. <laughs> Fucking hell, don't do that again. Uh, I did play the demo, so I know some of it. That no, was a long time ago. Uh, where's it going? Where's it going? Where's it going? Where's that pissing gun now? Reload it and shoot the bastard. Oh, straight in the head, my guy. Why does it look so dark? I may have, I may have to um, uh, change it in the editing because right now, for me, it's really dark. I think he is. Oh, call out to the mysterious figure. Help! Go get someone. There's been a shooting. Ah, no shit. Um. I don't understand why it keeps freezing that, like, like in like. Um, some some of the cutscenes for me. It's probably because it's an old game. Walk a bit faster, mate. I know you. I know you're crippled, but just walk a bit faster. That's a lot of zombies. Mind your head there, mate. Hello? Anybody? 
That's a sick house, I can't lie to you. Go to the house. Let's open the door. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Ah. Hello. I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. They're called zombies, mate. Or in your case, they're called walkers. Must be quarter and book. Jesus. Hey, Jesus ain't gonna help you in this minute. Idea. That was kind of funny. <laughs> oh, water. Anything good? Oh, what are you talking? Take it just in case. Nothing. Mm, the Marsh House. That's a Savannah area code. But that's the type of note you'd leave a babysitter. What's that beeping? <laughs> I was actually about to ask the same thing. Oh, answering machine or phone. Three new messages. Message one left at 5:43 p.m. Hey Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Oh, please tell me that was that little girl. I mean, not little girl. The, 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 mysterious, the mysterious figure in the woods. Finally, I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. Oh, Toto, do not do this to me. Right now, do not make me cry. Daddy? Huh? Hello? You need to be quiet. Uh, who is this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. Right, my name is Lee. My daddy. No. No. Not. Uh. You want to Choice is gonna load up. Uh, how old are you? Eight. And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. Okay. <laughs> where are, are your parents? parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in 
Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Um, where are you? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through Oh my god, it's Clementine! She's so tiny. What? What? Oh, you... I swear on, these games are giving me the maddest jump scares ever. <laughs> City bitch. Um, what can I do? What, 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 what can I do? Oh, kick. She is so small, what the hell? Must be Thor Odin's son. Bro, she looks like she looks like a mushed up spaghetti bolognese. Did you kill it? Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. She's so tiny now. The uh, hell? You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while. You know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened. But I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? I get out of here once the sun goes down. Look for help before it gets Look for help. Find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Let's go. Stay close to me. I just noticed that art um, design looks so much different in this game than the second season. Let's go. I'm just following Clem. Let's open the gate. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Um. I won't leave you alone. Good choice. Let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. I thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Um. What's going on? Do you know what the hell this is? No idea. So you've seen them then? You could say that. I'm Sean. Sean Green. The Sean? This is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... A babysitter. babysitter. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. I don't know if that was a good um, choice. I... 
Them monsters coming. We gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. Let's push this car, mate. Don't hump the car, push it, man. Get in the truck and drive somewhere. As babysitters go, I'd say your parents are you a tip. like a farm. That's the type of bomb I want to fucking build in Minecraft, but I don't think it's gonna happen. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. And I forgot his name. Chet, was it? Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here too. Been quiet as usual the past couple of days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, Chet, well, yeah, so that's his isn't he? You've brought a couple guests. Uh, your voice lies there. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then. Oh, babysitter. Not his daughter. He's the babysitter. Honey. Do you know this man? Yes. Okay then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Um, could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? Um, it's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. Sorry, I'm saying like the lines. I just don't know what else to say in these types of games. How'd this happen? Uh, car accident. That's so. Where are you headed before the car accident? Oh, it's Herschel from the actual um, I was getting um, uh, TV show. Says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about on the road. Who are you with, the girl? Uh, nobody. Is that so? Yeah. It is. You said we. That's all. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow... We gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Language. Uh... Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. Um, I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. 
Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it, really. I already said okay. Did well, you? I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you. She pissed off uh, her show. I want to speak to Clementine. She's a sick character. I can't lie to you. Stinks in there. Smells like. <laughs> uh, manure. I don't want to sweat in front of a child. Like when a horse plops. Just like that. I missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay.